The relentless line of waves breaking along a coastline represents a steady stream of energy. The problem is that the water in waves actually goes up and down, a motion which is hard to convert into a force pushing only one way, like a flowing river or a blowing wind. Scientists at the University of California, Berkeley, designed an underwater device, which they say not only solves this problem, but has a dual application. Our device has the advantage um, that we do not directly convert into electricity, we can decide ourselves if we want to produce fresh water or electricity. Their carpet-like mechanism that rises and falls with waves creates hydraulic pressure, pumping seawater towards the shore. The pressurized water can be used to run turbines generating electricity, or it can be pushed through special membranes that extract the salt to create fresh water. Marcus Lehmann says larger versions of the wave carpet could power small coastal communities. So in general, the available resource of um, wave energy is in the order of 15% um, of the global energy demand, which is a lot. Mechanical engineer Reza Alam says to avoid possible impact on coastal ecosystems, the wave carpet can be deployed in so-called dead zones, where there is not enough oxygen for marine life to thrive. Placing uh, a carpet on the seabed uh, in those locations uh, can, uh, is, is definitely absolutely safe uh, to the uh, environment. Alam says only one square meter of the wave carpet could supply enough power for two typical American homes, which on a larger scale means that the ocean could cheaply power up entire coastal towns. George Putich, VOA News, Washington.